Mechanical engineering encompasses so many things, it's kind of hard to nail down one definition. It touched basically almost everything, down to the ocean, to space. Any system that has fluids, any system that has materials or solids, manufacturing systems, design systems, robotics, biosystems. If it moves, it's mechanical engineering. You might even think about your phone, and you say, well, nothing's moving there. But there's heat transfer, there's packaging, there's manufacturing, and that's all mechanical engineering. In the mechanical engineering department at Northwestern, we try to be the leader in both education and research. And we study the fundamental principles at the core of mechanical science at the interface with other disciplines. Some of the most exciting work that's being done is in building in machine learning into so much of what we do in mechanical engineering. The fact that we can now design algorithms that can not just pick up patterns in data, but can make predictions, I think is one of the really exciting frontiers in mechanical engineering. We can build a physics-based model, but most of the time, they're too expensive to solve. So AI methods can help us to learn and extract very important information so that we can solve the problem more intelligently and more efficiently. We had the telephone, and that brought people together. And then think what adding video has added to that experience. And so one of the things that we're working on is how to bring touch to that. So how do we create robots that can convey the physical actions that we'd like to convey? We use simulations to study materials at scales we cannot see with the naked eye, or sometimes even with a microscope. One of the things that I'm doing in collaboration with doctors in Feinberg School of Medicine is to understand the function of the esophagus. So if I know the mechanical state of a particular person, that is a diagnostic tool. We want to develop methods such that we can fabricate products faster, cheaper, and better quality. We work on nanoscale design of membranes and filtration systems that can actually produce clean water in much more efficient ways. We have top research faculty in just about every area that we work in. You'll have a mechanical engineer working with a biomedical engineer. You'll have a mechanical engineer working with a physicist, working with a psychologist. We collaborate closely with the Shirley Ryan Ability Lab and the medical school. With Argo National Lab, just around the corner right here. It's really bring us closer to the users of the problems. There really are no boundaries here, and that's what makes it such a fabulous place. Mm -hmm.